and then two cooks as well. Now we've got everything we need and our grants come through. Still sitting with 34,000 which is good. Okay so we're going to go and take another grant out. And let's go for cell block A. So we're going to take cell block A. And we're now going to start to make some cells. Um, I should be able to build it into this actual thing, which would be quite cool. Just going to use my planning tool again. The minimum size for cells is a three by two. Oh, I don't know what do I? So here we've got three by two in our cell. That will work lovely. And if we do this for all of our cells, we end up with one on the end, is which is what I expected. And what we can put here is we can put solitary cells in here. And then that way when you have some prisoners that have been misbehaving, we can put them over into the solitary cells. Make sure they learn their lesson. Okay, and what I'll do is I won't put one here because we'll leave this as a corridor. And then we should expand up a little bit more. Just like so. Lovely. So now we end up with our solitary cell here again. And we'll delete that. So all these in. Just gonna go through all of these now. Um I've got to decide where I want my um, cells to come in. So I'm thinking this is just gonna be a corridor. So we we'll just have a little cell block here that we'll have people coming in and out of. We'll see what happens again. So we send that card all the way around. Um, so if I just leave that like that now, I think I can get one more sign. No, 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 I can't. I'm going to have to increase the foundations by one. Just, I can't make really get the yard. Oh, okay, and I can just build that there. So I'm going to go around and build my foundations for it. So I'm going to go around and build the foundation so we can see the flashlight. And we're going to just demolish this wall as well. Because we just want to build... Okay, so what we can have is our solitary cell back in there. And we can continue building like this. So we've got how many cells here? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Okay, so we only need to build these down here now. And then we'll actually have some cells. And we'll have 15 cells. Once we've got our 15 cells, we can then um, bring some prisoners in. And we'll start making some more money as well. Because at the minute, the only money we've got is just given to us. And then we'll as we get more and more staff, the money's been taken away from us. I might as well build these cells while I'm here. I don't think I'll get any cells in between them two. Oh, oh I've built that oh, no, brick wall at the top. That's good. And put the wall there as well. Get a cell in there. I'm just going to put cells wherever I can, really. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is go over to rooms and grab cell. Now, obviously, as I said last time, for the cells, I can just drag across like so. And it will make cells all the way through. Um, obviously, all of them do have warnings on them at the minute because nothing is connected. And that's the last switch right. Okay, and I've got a couple of utility problems as well. In the way of lights not working out properly, but that should sort it. So this is just going to be a little prison block here, nothing major. Might actually expand that out so and make that into a full block with the little yard off it as well. There's no other wrong with these cells, there's no room closed because they haven't got the jail doors on them that we need. And they need beds and toilets as well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab a bed. Beds are going to come off of the door wall 
Just like our assets in the offices, I do like all my cells to be rapidly uniform. And off the doors there. And hit, oh. Yeah, so and there. These are all going to be tucked behind the door, apparently. Because that's what I did accidentally. And once that's in, we can go to the toilets. Toilet and left about the bottom of the bed. So I'm going to go through and put all my top bunk all the toilets in as well. Did for that bed, just there, that was the most. And the toilets, put them all in the block in the cells that haven't got toilets yet. Every cell should now have a toilet in it, which it does. We'll go to our utilities, get a large pipe. We'll run it both ways. Then we'll grab a small pipe. Run it in. Then we go down. Off. Make sure we've got the toilets. Choosing that one. Up to the next that one. One up there, up there, up there. Just gotta make sure the line is drawn to all of them. Oh, and there is one that they can't get to, so I'm just gonna have to demolish it all there. One of them will be able to get to the pipe now. Shouldn't be able to get to the pipe now. Okay, one last one for them to put in. And now they're all connected, I can go through, get my concrete wall again, put it back. And then we're going to go through with our objects and gel doors. So we're just going to make sure we put a gel door on every cell. And if you notice up here where it says our garden, our money and stuff, just next to it, start counting up how many cells we've got. By showing us how many prisoners we can have, so at the moment we have zero out of nine cells. Nine cells ready. Oh, it's not that one there, because all we need is on solitary doors. With our solitary doors, we're going to put solitary cells like so. And then, after all that, then the doors are done. You see, we've got a capacity of 18. Oh, I do have one toilet not connected though. <laughs> Oh, my God.